We got some good news, everyone, as James Gunn has provided us with an update on the future of the brand separation that's happening within WB that concerns DC. So let's talk about the different imprints, the different labels, whatever you will, and how they're sort of taking shape into falling into place in this one universe that James Gunn is building opposed to the others. <laughs> So again, this comes at us from James Gunn, and he provided an update on what we can expect from the DCU, starting with how will the fans know, or the commoners, more importantly, know what the difference is. Well, think Marvel Studios, think DC Studios and DCU. He said that starting with the first DCU project, aka Creature Commandos, they will have a specific intro for the DCU and DC Studios. This intro will not appear on any cartoons, animated projects on TV, and or the Batman or Elseworld films like Constantine 2 if that happens and whatever else. They will have their own. They're going to have Elseworld branding and that's going to be their label. While everything DCU is going to have a DCU intro and a DC Studios label. So there's also been some confusion because some people think, oh, Elseworld is going to be like the Spotlight banner. No, because Marvel Spotlight is still in the MCU. They're just not crucial to the overarching plot. The Elseworld tales will be like the Batman, Penguin, whatever other spinoffs they make, Joker 2 and all that. They sit in their own separate universe outside of the DCU. Don't worry about what happens in those. It doesn't impact us. DCU, everything that's going to have an intro that's probably like Marvel Studios, because there's other studios now that rip that off, you're going to know exactly what it is because it's going to have DC Studios, DC Universe, you know, it's going to be crystal clear so there's no confusion. This makes sense. This is how you have to do it. This is the way it needs to be handled. So I'm cool with this, honestly. And to me, the most important part here is to separate this universe from everything that's going on. Because I've already seen some of my friends that are, that are a little more casual saying, wow, how is Robert Pattinson's Batman going to have a son? They already think that the next time they see Batman, it's Brave and the Bold. Like there is a degree of people that think Batman Part 2 is called Brave and the Bold. Because they don't know. Again, take me and you out of the equation who are mega nerds. Casuals aren't. They're the same ones sharing the poster from yabba dabba or whatever every day saying oh my god gargoyles 3 is coming out in 2024 i can't wait you idiot where's gargoyles 1 and 2 right that's the people that are uh gonna be a lot less confused when they see the branding 